You'll be safe so long as you stay in here. The rest of the house is obviously off limits. I've written down the hours they usually keep, but they're only estimates, okay? And I've drawn a map as well of the house. Better thought, eh? Good copper's wife. You hold up your end of the bargain, you'll have your life back in no time. Tom showed me something about Leah, and oh, she was so upset. People he wouldn't tell me why. Oh, Liam, are you all right? He's dead. Who's dead? What? Dan. He's dead. We belong together. been some kind of mistake. Um, hello? Yes, my name is Maureen Bellingham. Sweetheart, how yeah. about we try and get up, eh? It's dead. Oh. Oh. Um, look, Ari and I'll close up here. Why don't you take Leah home? Okay. Um, Sweetheart, please. Why don't we stand up, eh? I'll take you home. Please, love. Oh, cheers. Oh. Ah, the usual? Yes, please. Wow, you look a little tired. You've had a tough day. Yeah, I had a double shift. Ow. <laughs> How's Sal doing? Yeah, uh, physically she's making really good recovery. But tonight her uh, spirit seemed a bit down. Well, is there any reason for that? I don't know. It's obviously something worrying her. She didn't want to talk about it. But Pippa's with us, and maybe she can open up to her. Yeah, well, I'll uh, slip in and see her tomorrow, see how she's getting on. She'd appreciate that. Thank you. Hey, listen, um... Look at the house themselves tonight if you want to come over and maybe get some takeaway. Yeah, sounds good. Really? Mm -hmm. Do you want to switch to red? Sure, why not? Okay, uh, excuse me, Alf. Um, any chance of getting a nice bottle of top shelf red? Oh, mate, I don't know that we do nice. Uh, we do a good expensive, though. <laughs> I'll have a dig around and see if I can find something that won't melt your credit card. Cheers. Hmm, top shelf. Wow, good friends deserve good wine. Combination sides that you never quite know what you're going to end up with. I uh, see. The girl likes living dangerously. Well, sometimes. What about you? Oh, yeah, I have my moments. Hey, what's Sam's artwork like? I don't know. I've never seen it. She's one of these don't look at my work in progress types. We're under strict orders not to get in there. Oh, how would she know if you did? Ah, uh, she wouldn't because we're not going to. Oh, come on. You think you have your mind. It's just a little look. Rachel, moments of gravity, not stupidity, okay? I'm not going to take on my daughter in law. <laughs> Fair enough. Judging by the fancy bottle of wine they left here with, I'd say she's having a flash dinner somewhere with Tony. Yeah, I, I figured as much. Um, Tony's phone's turned off too. Love, if you do see them again, can you please get Rachel to call me? Irene, what's going on? Oliver. I hate telling you this over the phone, but there's been an accident. Dan's dead. He was on a camp and uh, I don't know, he was abseiling and, and something went wrong. Yeah, um, look, if there's anything I can do, uh... Yeah, thanks for that, love. Uh, look, I'm... I better go. Okay, bye. Look, where, where are you going to go and uh, make hot drink? Okay. What are we going to do? It's as if she's not even there. Oh, I'm just going to keep ringing around. I have to ring every flipping restaurant in the district. I've got to get hold of Rachel. I honestly don't know who to believe. Well, you know, my thoughts on Aidan Jeffries, I don't think I could trust him as far as I could throw him. It doesn't mean he did anything wrong, though, and he was so drunk she can't really remember anything. Yeah, which doesn't mean it was her fault. She'd never been in trouble before. That we know of. And even if she hasn't, as it was the first time. 
Oh, the way she and her brother have been brought up? Jeff's had his fair share of acting out. <laughs> You're really not fond of losing an argument, are you? <laughs> well, that was because I'm always right. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, that's an idea. And all the poor girl could do is just keep repeating, he's dead. He's dead. You'd reckon handling this sort of stuff would get easier as you get older, wouldn't you? No. <laughs> Lord knows we've had enough experience, haven't we? You know, sis, I'd never want to live anywhere else, but sometimes I can't help thinking that the gods have got it in for this town. What? Sally. What about Sally? Well, this is what she was worried about. The, the square up. Someone had to go in her place. Can you use a fork, you know? Oh, yeah, day two, and you're going to start thinking I'm a klutz. Hang on, so this is the day? No, 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 it's just two people enjoying each other's company. Yeah, right. However, if it was a date, I'd say it's going pretty well. But not being a date makes it a lot safer, doesn't it? Yeah. Is that OK? The, the fact that we've taken it easy since that first dinner? Yeah, I think this way it's, it's just happening. There's no trying. It's less stress. What's that? Uh, the answering machine. I turned it down. Hi, Tony. It's Irene here. Oh, love, sorry to bother you, but if Rachel's with you when you get this message, could you please get her to give me a call, please? Just a little pet. I put plenty of sugar in it. They say it's good for shock. What else to do? Me either, love. She needs a doctor and I've just about run out of ideas of where Rachel might be. I'm going to call the kids. They'd hate to be off having a good time knowing that this has happened. I'll call Drew. Sweetheart, do you, do you want to talk to him? To, to anyone? Well, look, I, I'm going to ring him. So if you do decide you want to speak to him, you let me know. I'm, I'm sure he'd love to.